Hey folks, welcome to the video. Um, today I just wanted to do a, a quick video on the AR-15 and the forward assist to kind of explain it and uh, uh, show you what it does. So this is my uh, AR-15 here and as you can see I've got it uh, taken apart a little bit and we can see the bolt. So this is the AR-15 bolt and as you can notice here on the side there's actually these little uh, indents cut all along the bolt and if you notice it's only on the one side of the bolt. So it's almost like little uh, little spots there that something can grab a hold of. Now, what's going to grab a hold of it is the forward assist. So if we take a look at the rifle itself here. If you can see in there, you can see a little pin inside the bolt, or inside the uh, upper receiver, moving back and forth when I press this button, which is the forward assist right here. And when we put the uh, AR-15 back together, as you'll notice, this is the bolt here and the forward assist here. Those little notches line up with the forward assist. So we're going to go ahead and reassemble our, our bolt a little bit here and show you. So if you watch, as I'm pressing this, it's actually moving the bolt forward. You'll see I can almost push it right in. So basically the purpose of the forward assist how the AR-15 works, it uses a system uh, called direct impingement. And what that does is when the rifle is fired, the bullet obviously exits the barrel. But right here, uh, there's a little gas uh, port in the barrel. And the gas is actually siphoned back up through a tube all the way back into the receiver where it meets with the bolt. And this tube interfaces with the uh, gas key on the bolt. And that gas, when the rifle is fired, is what causes it to cycle. So it unlocks the bolt throws the carrier group back, and then the spring in the buttstock will actually push it forward loading a new round. Now, it's a good system, but the problem with this system is that because you have gas coming right back into the bolt, it can cause things to get gummed up and uh, carbon fouled and so on and so forth, which can cause reliability issues. So what they've done essentially is they've uh, integrated the forward assist to overcome uh, this issue when the rifle's dirty after having fired a lot. Now, chances are in civilian life when you're just at the range shooting your AR-15 for recreational purposes, you're probably never going to actually need to use it because uh, most gun owners clean their rifle uh, after they're done using it and you're really not going to be firing enough rounds unless you're firing some really dirty ammunition to require that at the range just for one trip. Um, the primary focus was for a military application where you're going to be firing uh, the rifle quite a bit and uh, maybe not have a chance to clean it. So you can actually uh, still use it even if it's quite dirty. So I'm gonna throw this back together and we'll show you. Now, it's actually part of military drills to use the forward assist every time you uh, cock the rifle. And then it's just integrated into the drills so it's an automatic, uh, an automatic function, it's just muscle memory. So we'll go ahead put this guy back together. And we'll show you. So, when you load around, the bolt goes forward, and you can press this, which will push the bolt all the way forward. So I'll show you, actually. If you do not uh, load the rifle properly, so typically when you release it, you're supposed to pull it back and release it completely. If you ride the bolt forward, you can actually see why sometimes that can cause a jam. I'll try to get it here. So, it's going fully into battery here, but sometimes it can get caught in a position like that. Now this can also happen if your uh, rifle's dirty, but simply by pressing on the forward assist, it causes it to lock back into place. Let's so my spring is quite good, so it's not allowing me to do this, but Essentially, sometimes it can get locked open like that, and if you press on the forward assist, it will push it and lock it all the way forward so that the bolt goes into battery. So, essentially, that is what the forward assist is for, how it works, and uh, why it's in the AR-15 platform. So, if you like the video, go ahead and give me a like, uh, subscribe if you'd like, and thanks for watching.